Hello everyone, this is Paul back with another VX Integrity video. In this video, we'll take a look at analyzing the corrosion on a pressure vessel head using the freeform analysis of the surface damage sweep. Let's jump right into it. So in this scenario, I'm going to leave the default parameters as is. They're going to work for our mesh. Same thing for the color map. In this section, I'm going to add a rejection criterion, setting it to two millimeters for the deepest point. So any feature that's beyond two millimeters will be flagged with a red X in our report. In this step, it's optional, but if you want to, you can add a reference line or even an annotation. So I'll go ahead and add something such as north side and anchor it to the top here. In this step, we're going to want to exclude all the areas that we don't want to analyze. So I'll show you the quickest way to do it in this case. First thing is that I'm going to select the brush selection tool as well as toggle the select through button here. And I'm going to go ahead and select all that section here. But now I want to make sure that notice at the top there's corrosion and on the sides as well, there's corrosion there. So I want to make sure to deselect that. So it's actually going to be analyzed. So let's go ahead and use the freeform selection tool. And the way to deselect areas is to hold down control and shift at the same time, then paint your box as usual. And at the end, right click to confirm. So once again, control and shift, paint your box, right click at the end to confirm. So I'll do the same thing at the top. At the top, I will untoggle the select through button so it doesn't select all the way through. It just selects the top. And once again, holding down control and shift, I draw my circle, right click, and there we have it. So we're gonna proceed to the next step, to the analysis preview. And you'll see in the analysis preview that we can actually visualize the reconstructed mesh here. Notice that the reconstructed mesh should pretty much follow the curvature of the green section. It's an extension of the good reference surface of our pressure vessel head. Okay, and this is what is gonna be used to estimate the depth of our corrosions. So finally, we get to the analysis step. Notice there's a total of seven features identified. We can see the one at the top, the one on the side, we, the one on the actual pressure vessel. Notice there are a few damages that are flagged with a red X because they are deeper than two millimeters based on our rejection criterion. And finally, if we want to, we can even go ahead and add some depth annotations so that it appears with nice uh, values in the report. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and drop us a like and consider subscribing to our Creaform channel. This was Paul, and I'll see you in the next video.